welcome back to my channel. My name is Summer and I've got another wax haul to share for you. I've got a repeat purchase from Lavender and Speckle Scents and I'm so happy to get this order. You guys, I placed this order like two days ago. Mind you, Beth's shop is in Alabama and I live in Alabama as well, but still, I'm pretty sure whatever day you order, she ships it the same day, if not the next day and drops it off at the post office and it's gone like fastest shipping ever. So, super excited because I couldn't wait to get my hands on these. She did a restock on, I want to say January the 2nd, and um, I wasn't there right on time because I was mommying, so I couldn't get there right at release time, but I got there like 30 minutes later, so I did miss out on the pine cones and spice, I think she called it. Charity was raving about that scent, so I hope she brings it back. Um in another release but anywho I did pick up quite a few things that were left so I was very lucky and let's hop right into my order so she always includes an invoice which is really nice and then she so kindly like writes um when to warm them like if they're good to warm or if you need to warm them after whatever date on each of the scents which is so kind she includes a business card which is the same one as last time of course because that was just like a week ago and then she included another handwritten note, which I think is such a sweet, like special touch. It says, hi Summer, thank you so much for your order. I hope you enjoy everything, Beth. Thank you so much, Beth. And I have no doubt that I will because your stuff is just amazing. So let's see, the first thing I have here is blackberry funnel cake. The notes are blackberry jam and funnel cake. Actually, no, I'm gonna stop myself because I'm the worst. Starting with samples. Why do I never remember to start with samples? Like, I just think I just get so excited that I just like go right into it. But anyway, she did include a sample. This is funnel cakes and coffee. So, sounds right up my alley with a bakery. Coffee blend. Oh my gosh, this is really nice. So, this is like cinnamon and then like the bready note of a funnel cake, like that cakey, bready cinnamon and like just a hint of coffee but I love that like the coffee doesn't overtake this which sometimes like espresso or really strong coffee notes like it's all you can smell but mm, this is great actually I like it a lot more than I thought so I love that I'm so happy to have it okay now let's go blackberry funnel cake so the notes again are blackberry jam and funnel cake and I love her funnel cake like that her funnel cake is like, it has cinnamon, but it's not like too much cinnamon. Some funnel cake um, notes are just like cinnamon and that's all I can smell. So I really enjoyed that one. So I'm sure this one's gonna be no different. Let's see. Ooh, her blackberry jam is really good. Sometimes blackberry and sometimes raspberry can lean like body care to me. This one's different. It actually smells like like blackberry but not in a body care way to me it smells kind of like a you know how blackberries are sort of tart is that the, even the correct word you guys know what I'm talking about but yeah it smells really good and her funnel cake like I said it is I don't want to say it's mild because it has a lot of fragrance but it's just not overly cinnamon it's really pretty so I'm excited to try this on warm next we have berry waffle cone sweet berries freshly baked waffle cone and creamy vanilla She says, warm after 121. Mostly are, most are freshly poured, so be sure to wait until after warming date below for best performance, okay? Oh my gosh, I smell all three of these notes. I get the creamy vanilla mostly with the sweet berries and the baked waffle cone in the back, but blended so beautifully. I'm sure since this is freshly poured that the berries and the waffle cone will come out more on warm, but yeah, this is just a creamy berry bakery. It's really nice. This one is apple and pine, mac apple, roasted pine cone, and spice. So I got this one because this is like the roasted pine cone and spice, but throw a little mac apple in. And so I really wanted to just kind of try this out to see kind of like what the roasted pine cone and spice would be like. Mmm, it's really nice. So let's see. I'm going to take one of these out. I get mac apple most, but I do get the pine cone and spice like... Like I can smell it, but it's mostly apple. 
Let me see when this one was poured or when I should warm this one. Um, apple and pine. Okay. Oh, she said it's good to warm. Okay, great. Hmm. So yeah, roasted pine cone is one of my favorites. And so I'm really anxious to try just the roasted pine cone and spice. But the apple, addition of the apple is really, really pretty. I like mac apple. Okay, next is bum bum, or boom boom, I think it's pronounced. Coconut cream, pistachio, tonka, vanilla, and sandalwood. And she says... Warm after January 21st. Okay, sometimes Boom Booms are too, like, rich and creamy for me. It's too much of, like, a cologne vibe, like, with the sandalwood. But I'm really loving hers. It's creamy still, but it's lighter. It's not as, like, heavy and cologne-y, like, perfumey smelling. It's really nice. So, I like this a lot. All right. Next is called So Sweet Pumpkin Pecan Waffles Blended with White Cake. Ooh, that sounds good. This one, she says, good to warm. So good. Okay, so excited. Let's see. Ooh. This is really good. I really like her white cake. Okay. So I get the white cake most of all, and I do get the pumpkin pecan waffles, but I actually thought it was going to be the opposite. I really enjoyed this. It's like a toned down, cakey pumpkin pecan waffle. Like, it's really good. So, so excited for this one. I wouldn't think to mix white cake with pumpkin pecan waffles, but y'all, that smells good. All right. Next is balsam vanilla woods, which is balsam fir blended with icy vanilla woods. I think I got this one in my first order. I can't remember. She says for this one, warm after January 21st. Okay. Yeah, I love this. It's just, it smells like a fresh Christmas tree in a winter forest. It smells really good. Perfect for this time of year. Next, I got two of these. This is a repeat purchase. This is Beach Night Cookies. Beach Nights, Boardwalk, Marshmallow Clouds, and Sugar Cookie Royale. I really liked this one for my first order. I don't even know if I put up my first order yet. If not, um, it's coming. And y'all, this is so good. Beach Nights and Sugar Cookie Royale. It's just, it's so good. If you like Beach Nights, this is just gives it a bakery flair. And, I mean, who doesn't love that? I know I do. So, this is really a good one. Next is Berry Berry Pie, which is strawberry pound cake, blueberry cobbler, and flaky pie crust. Yummy. This one says warm after January 21st. Oh, my gosh. So, so yummy. I get the blueberry cobbler the most and then the strawberry pound cake and pie crust. This is so delicious. I almost, I debated not even getting this one, so I'm really glad I did because this is a favorite. This is good. Next, we have blueberry toasted marshmallows, fresh blueberries, toasted marshmallows, and sugar cookie royale. This one, warm after January 14th. Okay, yeah, this is like a different blueberry. It's more of like an artificial blueberry, not necessarily in a bad way. It's just different than the blueberry cobbler from the berry berry pie. So it's more of like an artificial blueberry. I definitely get the marshmallows. I don't know that I smell super, like a lot of sugar cookie royale, but again, I have to wait a couple of weeks to melt this one, so. I'm sure it'll come out more on warm. And then next I have strawberry musk. This is strawberry pound cake blended with icy vanilla woods. I think this is another repeat purchase. Warm after January 21st. And yeah, I love this one. It's like a an earthy, woody strawberry in the best way. It smells really nice. 
Man, she can really do some blending. This is good. Okay, and the last thing I have here is pumpkin berry pancakes. This is blueberry cobbler and pumpkin pecan waffles. Two of my favorite scents. And this is good to warm, she said, okay? This is a favorite, you guys. You can smell the pumpkin pecan waffles. You can smell the blueberry cobbler. Her blueberry cobbler note is, is I like it much better than the fresh blueberries one. It's delicious. I would definitely get more of this. So that is everything from my second lavender speckle, lavender and speckle scents order. I'm so pleased. Customer service, the personalized note, the fast shipping, the definite like restocks, the great array of scents that she offers. Um, I can't say anything bad about the shop. So if you guys haven't tried her out, I will leave all of her shop information and her Facebook group in my description box down below. Let me know if you've tried out her shop, if you want to try out her shop, what you're most looking forward to, or if you did purchase, what were some of your favorites. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in another video very soon. Bye.